Susan Bowles, mother of the origami killer's latest victim. Maybe she knows something about the circumstances surrounding her son's death. No answer. Baby screaming inside. Not a promising start. I should have a look around. There should be another way to get in. Baby screaming and no answers. Don't like the look of this. Ah. Asthma free for the moment and loving it. Good old inhaler in my pocket, just in case. Anybody home? Mrs. Bowles? Doesn't seem to be anyone. Hmm. I don't know why, but I got a bad feeling about this. Jeez. Parents today. Going out and leaving a poor little kid like that. Oh, Jesus. letter. Holy fuck. I hope she, I hope she hasn't. Come on, I have to search the house. Maybe it's not too late. Hello, little cutie. Who? Oh, you looking for your mama? Come on, I have to search the house. Maybe it's not too late. Come on, I have to search the house. Maybe it's not too late. Mrs. Bowles? Mrs. Bowles, are you there? Mrs. Bowles! Mrs. Bowles, can you hear me? Wake up! Wake up! Oh, there you go. I'm gonna call an ambulance. No, I... I don't want to go to the hospital. Please. Okay. You got something around here I can dress this wound with? Yeah. I think so. Okay. Don't move. I'll be right back. Quick, she's losing blood. I gotta hurry. Let's see. I need this. And this. And this. I'm here for you, Susan. You'll be all right. I'll take care of you. There, I done what I can. That should stop the bleeding. Well, luckily, the wounds aren't too deep. Hey, how are you feeling? You okay? My baby. My baby needs me. Right. You stay there. I'll take care of the baby. Okay? Do you know what to do? With a baby, I mean. 
I'm a private eye. There's nothing I can't do. <laughs> I was a private eye when I walked in here. Gotcha. Mommy will live for now. Let's see how Junior's doing. Hi there, Emily. So, what seems to be the problem, huh? Oh! Going by the smell? I got a pretty good idea. Okay. How do you do this again? There you go, fresh new baby. <laughs> that should feel better. Right, Emily? Mm. Hey, what's the matter? I thought we solved the problem. Maybe she's hungry. Why is she crying? I'll ask Susan. She'll know what to do. Doesn't look ill. Why is she crying? I'll ask Susan. She'll know what to do. Uh, Susan, uh, I changed her diaper, but she's still crying. She's hungry. There's a bottle in, in the kitchen. Gotcha. The baby's bottle. Susan said it was in the kitchen. The baby's bottle. Susan said it was in the kitchen. I guess I better warm this thing up. Oh, Emily, are you hungry? Hmm? Huh? You hold on. I'll just tilt this bottle a little bit so you don't choke. Oh, good job, Emily. Hmm? You're feeling good now, right? Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> now, I'm going to rock you very gently so you can have a nice little snooze. Okay. Right, that's about the limit of my maternal powers. Poor kid. Life ain't gonna be easy for her. Thanks for looking after my baby. I didn't want to leave her. I just couldn't cope anymore. Just not having Jeremy around. He was such a good boy. I can't understand why anyone would want to hurt him. Do you take care of this baby on your own? Doesn't Jeremy's father live with you anymore? He disappeared. The day after Jeremy. I don't know what happened to him. Maybe... Maybe he couldn't take it. Ever since I've had to look after Emily all on my own and... I couldn't do it anymore. I understand. Did your husband say anything before he disappeared? Did he leave a note or something? No. He left the house without a word and... There was just a cell phone. A cell phone? Yeah, I, I found a cell phone in his dresser. I'm sure it wasn't his, I'd never seen it before. I tried to turn it on, but it didn't work. Do you still have it? Yeah, it's, uh, it's in a drawer in the living room. You can have it if you'd like. I'm sure it's of more use to you than to me. Do you have any family or anybody to help you? Yeah, my mother. I didn't want to ask her for anything. We don't really get along. But I guess I'm out of options. Well, look after yourself. And Emily. I will. I promise. In a drawer in the living room. That's what Susan said. In a drawer in the living room. That's what Susan said. Good luck, Emily. You take care of your mama. <laughs> 